There, oh boy, that's a big Whoa. fish. Big fish. Welcome to Fishing with Latin with Latin Langman and co-host Steve Ronholt. You can buy that expensive tackle that you think that you might need. You can head out for the river and hope you might succeed. But if you want to fish just right, just turn your TV on. Come on, fish with Latin, he'll get your fishing on. Yeah, come on, fish with Latin, and you'll have some fun. Can't some fly in Alaska on the wild Yukon, or catch some trout and salmon in good old Washington. Fishing with Latin, casting with Latin, man, that's a lot of fun. Fishing with Latin, casting with Latin, man, that's a lot of fun. Ladies and gentlemen, we're here at Amber Lake, Washington. Uh, we're hoping to have a great day of fishing. The wind's supposed to kick up today, so we're not sure what's going to happen. But stick around. I think it'll be a great show. We're fishing here at Amber Lake, and uh, we got out, out a little bit in the middle of the morning here. Started fishing with coronamids and had a couple hits early on in about 15 feet of water. And uh, then kind of wasn't catching anything for quite a while, so moved out into a little deeper water. And there we go. That's a fish for sure. Steve had hooked into the first fish of the day. All right, good job. Yeah. 20 feet, 20, 21 feet, something like that. I think it brightened up a little bit and they moved to a little deeper water. Cool. Yeah, it's a nice rainbow. Got him. Yeah, really nice rainbow. Beautiful. Trying to see which fly it was on, but I think they all popped out, so I still don't know. <laughs> Got two different flies on there. Boy, that's a nice rainbow. That's got to go 18 inches, probably. Three pounds, maybe. All right. That was a nice rainbow trout. We've been uh, working here with coronamids for a little while. Started out about 13, 15 feet. Um, when it was a little bit cloudier and I think they moved out into a little deeper water either following the hatch or because it's getting sunny or I don't know which one but that was a really nice couple pound rainbow. Even though the indicator is not very far from the boat it doesn't really matter because we have so much lying underneath the indicator probably about 19-20 feet so it shouldn't spook the fish and it's very difficult to cast, so we're just kind of flipping it out there a little bit and letting it ride the wind. Yeah. Nice. There she is. Awesome. I strip my line to keep the pressure on the fish. Very cool. Woo. Get my line in here. It feels like a weighty fish, Steve. There's some really nice trout in this lake, for sure. I still haven't seen it. It's just dogging way down. Probably a big fish, Yeah. Huh? Sure feels like it. Yeah, it's got a good bend on your rod, that's for sure. Yeah. That's cool. I'm using a strike slip indicator. So once the fish hits, I set the hook, it pulls free and slides down the line. And it's really handy for this deep chronomid fishing, anything probably over 10 feet deep, it's a good thing to use. Come on, fish, I want to look at you. Get you in Powerful, the net. powerful fish here in Amber Lake. Mm. Whoa, there she goes. <laughs> That's cool. Ah, ah golly, what a bummer. Mm. Gosh, that was a good fish. Never got to look at it. Probably a small one then, huh? Yeah. Darn it. <sighs> Here's one. All 
right. Nice job, Steve. <laughs> spit you lose it? Yeah, I spit the hook. Today, Steve and I are using chronomids. However, there's other fishermen doing very well, either trolling balanced leeches or even casting leeches toward shore and stripping them back in. There's fishermen in the background catching fish, making us look bad. <laughs> yep. <laughs> All right, nice. That was cool. Cool. <laughs> what a jump. Yeah, that was good so cool. fish. <laughs> Ooh, man, he wanted to jump again. Yeah. That's pretty cool. I'm going to stay down a little bit so I don't catch the wind too much here. Yeah. Looks like a real nice fish. Looks pretty good. Yep, action's picking up quite a bit. Yeah. Yeah, on the bloodworm. Finally saw the fly that caught a fish on. Yeah, great. Yeah. So it goes. Nice. Yeah, I don't know, 12 inch or so. A rainbow. That's pretty cool. We've caught a few fish here now in a row, maybe three or four strikes in the last half an hour, getting our uh, blood worm and coronamid pattern down close to bottom, about 20 feet or so, and uh, it's been some pretty hot action now, so hopefully it's picking up. Be sure to join us next time for more Fishing with Lad, because we're having fun catching fish. <laughs>